Wood is one of the most versatile products on the market. So versatile, it's hard to consider what life would be like if there was none around. However, it does have some shortcomings based on how it's used. For example, it's not as strong as metal, which is far more sturdy and rigid than wood. However, researchers at the University of Maryland College Park have come up with a relatively easy method that converts wood into a stronger material of itself. How did they do it? The wood was boiled in a combination of sodium hydroxide and sodium sulfite. The mixture breaks the plant cell's natural bonds up, after which the wood is exposed to heat and compressed. Researchers said the wood's weakened state causes the cell's walls to completely collapse and densification. The heat allows the new bonds to be created in the extremely dense wood, causing it to become more powerful and lighter than the majority of metals. The new material is 10 times stronger and 20 times as firm, which makes it a worthwhile choice for construction where metal is often used. The recreated wood can stop bullets and be used as an inexpensive armor. It's not as protective as Kevlar, but costs a minute less than what Kevlar takes to generate. Scientists are now faced with the task of developing a new material on a larger scale. This is the biggest obstacle they face, but if it happens, it can mean a plethora of options for engineers, architects, etc. You can learn more about this super wood in the journal Nature.